Our big picture for today takes the form of a pictorial report. We will be showing three separate stories instead of the usual single subject. However, the three stories are interrelated. The first deals with medicine, the second with experimentation, and the third with construction. But all are concerned with some of the Army's peacetime roles. Now, part one of today's pictorial report. None of nature's malevolent forces strikes with greater violence than the tornado. The tornado's wake is a path of wreckage and annihilation. It is as though some giant steel ball had been rolled along the earth, crushing and smashing all that stood in its way. Unfortunately, tornadoes may strike in almost any section of the United States, usually with little or no warning. Worse than the effects on homes and business property is the tornado's impact on human life. In its wake, too, are left the killed and maimed. The tornado is a natural disaster which tries a community's resources to the extreme. Recently, Brook Army Hospital in Texas undertook a test to see just how effective it would be in handling the mass civilian casualties of a natural disaster. The mock disaster was slated to affect the city of San Antonio. In the wake of the mock tornado, there will be nearly 1,000 simulated casualties to be treated by Brook Army Hospital. Of this number, 800 cases will be listed as serious injuries. The remaining 200 cases will require emergency treatment. Playing the parts of the thousands of simulated civilian casualties are the soldiers ordinarily on duty with the Brook Medical Center's schools.